Our apartment's annoying us a bit because it takes like an hour and a half minimum to get into town. So that's three hours traveling every day. And on top of that, our next door neighbors, I don't know what they're up to, but they've tried to get into our apartment twice drunk. So, well, they've like tried the handle, it's not like yeah, they, but Lottie's yeah. been in the kitchen cooking and then seen the handle like slowly turn around, and, and I've had to go in and finish and everything off. And like voices, really weird. Yeah, so it's not, it's not too nice, but we still feel safe. Yeah, yeah, still feel well. safe. <laughs> there he is, <laughs> no one's trying to get in. <laughs> so, we're in a different part of Tokyo today. We're um. We normally go to the west side, but we're now in the east side. Oh, I thought it was the other way around. <laughs> yeah, we're, no, we're in the east today, and it's a lot more quiet. It's just a lot nicer. Yeah, it's uh, a it bit took, more pleasant. Yeah, it took us about in between an hour and an hour and a half to get here. This is going to be where we stay when we come in next time. So this place hasn't got like mega good reviews or anything. I just saw it online and thought it'd be cool to go to. The emperor lives here. So you can't actually go into like the castle living area building bit, but you can just walk around the gardens and it's just, it's basically just another castle, but in Tokyo. We just came into the science museum and it's like five quid to get in. And I know that's not a lot of money, but for a museum it is. For a museum it is, yeah. It makes me realise how good the National History Museum is in London and the science one. Like, they're free and they're so good. You've got to go through like a security checkpoint, but then you can't go into, the, like I said before, you can't go into the actual bit he lives in, but you can walk around the gardens. And the gardens are open to the public, I think, when the Emperor wants them to be, which is pretty much all the time. And if you look on this map, the darker, the darker area here is the garden, which we can walk around. All of this area is the palace, which you can't, but I think you can get kind of close and see it. So we're going to walk around the garden and then we're going to go to the palace. It's a nice start. What's over here? Tired. One of the trees is starting to blossom. I don't think it's fully in bloom, but it looks nice. Oh, Lottie's gone over there. I was talking to her. It must look really nice when they're all in bloom. I've never, I've, we've only seen, we've gone around a lot of Japan, we've only seen two in bloom, but looks cool, doesn't it? Wow, this art is amazing. The architectural design just, you know, it blends so well seamlessly with the art deco, like, architecture. It makes you feel more... Oh, oh. I think we found another cherry blossom tree. It's is like, this cherry blossom? I don't know. It looks like it, but it just looks like a white version. It's pretty, isn't it? Mm. We've just come around the corner and there's loads of there's cherry blossoms. Yeah. They're, they're blooming. It looks so cool. Look, it's all pink. <laughs> okay, so we just read on that sign there, I don't know if you can see it, that they're, <laughs> that they're plum blossoms, not cherry blossoms. We've been walking around the park for ages now. And I'm getting hungry. Yeah, like he's complaining, our tummy's rumbling, so we're going to go find a toilet and <laughs> <laughs> we're, we're going to go, because you've got to pay to go in the station, so as soon as we go in to get our lunch, we have to leave after, because I'm not paying to go in the station and paying to come out again. Um, so we're going to go to the uh, Emperor's house, say hi to him, and <laughs> yeah, we're on our way there now. I'm not going to record the west, rest, west, rest of the garden, because it looks like this. <laughs> <laughs> so if I'm honest, I thought it was going to be a little bit like Buckingham Palace, like you can just go right up and there's a bit more to see, but it's uh, it's all quite hidden, but the parks around are massive, like it's almost like Central Park, like it's just like all the big tower buildings and then just complete flat, which is really nice. When I asked that, I asked the security lady, can you see, um, can you see inside the palace at all or like anything? And she said no, but if you come down just where we came down there's a famous bridge don't know why it's famous but so that's the bridge looks nice it looks like something you'd find in england so it turns out you can see like guard kind of people i thought it would be a bit like buckingham palace but it kind of is like you'll see there just there that's enough of the park we're hungry some of these ducks are sleeping with their heads in but then they're swimming around even though they're sleeping Lottie did some research <laughs> and found out there's a vegan cafe and it's in like this really old um, train station so <laughs> people laugh at us. What's happening? What's going oh, on? Got... Yeah, we're going for dinner in here. We can actually try some real Japanese food now so 
Back loads to pick from. It's quite expensive, but oh yeah, veggie gyozas. Yeah. Oh, sick. Let's go. Rate out of ten. Ten. A bit expensive though. So we're back. The noodles were delicious. Like they were. Um. I had like a soy sauce kind of sauce and then the gyozas were like really nice, they're like vegetable gyozas and we also had, what else did we have, oh we had like some soy That's meat and it was really really nice, Lottie's talking to her mum and dad and uh, yeah we're just um, we're just chilling out now, we're actually leaving Tokyo tomorrow so we've got to pack yeah, a load of our stuff up and then we're heading to so somewhere mean? special so we're going to, um, I'm going to pack up all our stuff, get ready and I'll show you where yeah, we're going tomorrow, to peace Bye bye, thank you very much, thank you